All right, and welcome back to more grime on AXF Play Gaming with me, Alex. We're back at the lair. Uh, I'm gonna try to find spots here and there. I believe uh, I got a bit of a tip that we need to go from the crab boss room, I think. And I think it was this one. I think. Let's see. Yeah, this is the bo this is the crab boss room, and we needed to like go like down, and then break some walls. So probably here. We need to break some walls apparently. Actually, I can just do that. So maybe this way. Okay, so we need to go like... Oh, I see. I think I see. Oops. Right here, maybe. We need to go like below somewhere. Sprint! But yeah, last time... We actually managed to uh, beat a couple bosses. Well, maybe not last time was a couple bosses. Uh, last time was the... Boss that lets me warp between surrogates, which is a big deal. Right here? Mm. Hello. <laughs> uh huh. So maybe down here somewhere. No, this is where the bone is. Here? No. Oh. Ah, so you need to smack that to go down here. Oh, I see you, buddy. I'm just gonna punch him to death. Ah, too early. It's been a while since I fought these guys. Ah! There we go. It's so dark here. Yeah, right here too, right? Ah, I think I saw it right here. Yeah, <sighs> there we go. Not this way, to the right. Hello. Oh, should not be here, nor should I. But me see eye to eye. Let's see. So there's a shop. Ooh, a hunt point? Oh, 7,000 chunk. Bone bird armor. Oh, this could actually be good for me. That's Dex and the other stat, right? So I'm going to have to grind a little bit. Hmm. Can be used to infuse a single attack with a command. I don't even know what a command is. Blood Metal Scythe. Do not have the stats for it. So, big things is the armor and the Crimson Icor. And now we have a shortcut back here. So we got the shop. But I think they also said there was another boss that I missed, apparently. Uh, I'm trying to remember, though. Uh, the hint I got to get to the boss. Ow, I didn't even see that guy. I was not paying attention.
Let me check my map. See if I see anything. Hmm. See, like, maybe, maybe there? But that's not how... I didn't get from there from Feaster's Lair, though. I think I got from above in the desert. Because that's gloomness, yeah. Right? Then we have a core. I don't think I filled out Lithic quite there. But you know what? Uh, we're gonna hold off. At least I found the shop and we have something to look forward to in terms of... Actually, am I going... Okay, no, I did not go the right way. Uh, I'm just gonna warp out of here and do... The other area for now. Just so we can get some uh, mass... So, back to child bit we go. Alright, so now back here. We beat the boss that was below and to the left. I can't quite do anything here though, because I don't have whatever ability I need to use... The thing that's above me right around here. It's like a little warp thing. Maybe I can like fling myself or something. That's my guess. You have anything to say? Destroy the hose. Yeah, well, yeah, whatever. Alright. Um, I don't think I kept going left from here though. Or can I even do that? Let's find out. Okay, there's a wall there. And a lot of teeth. A little bouncy pad. Okay, so this is like a shortcut. Blooming legs. Nice. So eventually I'll come back here and this will be basically my shortcut. Hmm, so let's go to the right then. Pretty much our only way to go. Boom. Ow. Okay, so that just hurts me. Okay, so I can't get rid of those flowers, so they're just an obstacle. Oh boy. Okay, they just blew up immediately for whatever reason there. That hasn't happened before. Weird. Well, I guess it's time to use the scythe for a little bit just to have that extra range. It will be slower though, so I have to keep that in mind. That was close. Actually, should I go below first? Oh, bird guy. And then, huh. So will I be able to dash up and down maybe soon? Boom. Hmm. Let's see. So we can't break that. So we can't go this way at all. Doesn't seem like it anyways. So our only choice is to go to the right here. Too early. There. Get out of here. Stupid plant. Chunk? Chunk. Hmm. Okay. We have... Hmm.
Okay, so maybe if I fall... No, there's a... There's a wall here to prevent me from doing that. So maybe I'm getting some sort of... Thing. Hmm. What if I... Oops. Forgot it was immediately right there. Can I... Yeah. Okay, I made it through. Hmm. Okay, it's permanent. I thought it was timed, so I was a little afraid there. Okay. Okay, bouncy path to get us back up. Uh, I can go up here. Oh, it is timed. Okay, bouncy pads. Oh, this leads back up. Oh, okay, I see what they're trying to make me do here. Now we write this up, if uh, whatever it decides to go up. Okay, I kind of glitched there, but it's fine. Okay, so now we can get this chunk, but I think that's pretty much all I can do here, unless I'm missing something. Well, I can dash through here. But we didn't have that. Okay. How do I pull that, though? Because... Like this, I need to pull it up. Ow. Hmm. Okay. Dash, 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 dash. Jump, dash. There we go. Alright, alright. We're getting places. We're getting places. Uh. I don't really have a map here, though. Oh. Dash through! Ah! It's fine. Hmm. This is suspicious. Hey! The chest piece. Neat. <laughs> Ow! Get up, sword. Okay. Hmm. Seems like maybe there's something here, or, or is that just? I think that's my just my normal. Yeah, I think that's my normal attack, just bouncing off. Okay, so I'm back here. Nothing here. Hmm. How do I get to that? Weird. I'm not sure if I can reach anything here in the... the child bed now, though. Unless there was stuff to go from the left of the surrogate, because to the right is pretty much done, I think. Oh, that's you as well. That's right. Pain! Yeah, you saw motley pearls. Could come in handy later. I haven't used any, but I, I'm already feeling certain abilities that I'm not really liking very much. 
Okay, so can we drop here? Nope. I saw something on the left there, so... I can't reach it, though. Ah! Yeah, I totally cannot. Let's just rest here. This enemy is something so weird. Anyways, um, can I go down? Hmm. Can't break the wall there, but there is a shortcut or breakable wall right there, so. I'm just checking all the floor here. Can't punch that. Yeah, and there's, a, there's the little black portal things that I haven't figured out how to exactly use. So yeah, whatever whatever this is, I can't do anything, and I can't leave normally. Hence, why they gave me the ability to warp out, because otherwise I would just get soft lock here because I can't leave. See, I can't reach that. I don't get I don't get my dash back fast enough. So or am I just timing this wrong? Can I pull it more actually? Now that I think about it, let's find out. So if I do this and I do this, I cannot pull it again. Hmm. So how do I reach that? I need some sort of long jump? Hmm. Or maybe I just need to really like do it last second maybe. Ah. There we go. No, I can't make that. It's just a tiny bit too far. No punch there. NPC right there. Can I break this? Nope. Hmm. Uh, is there a way to tell if the floor is breakable specifically? That one's... you can move, but I don't think... yeah, I don't think I can make it there. And then we have this... from the, uh, world pillar. But that is not how I originally got here. So let's actually go to the nerf root thing and explore from there. Maybe I, I, I can get my, my answers here. Let's see, so... Uh... Wait, where is it? Lithic, Lithic, Unfirm Desert... Nerf Root, there it is.
Okay, so... I'm trying to remember. I'm gonna try this way, if I can reach it. And then we'll try the other way into child bed. Okay, so... Keep going left, then down, and then to the right. I've been there before, I think. Yeah, this is the, the original route I took, I think. To child bed. Yeah, and I can't do anything about that black vortex thing. Yeah, I went straight down from here. Yeah, I remember this, kind of. Because at this point, uh, since I don't have the map, it doesn't mark anything I discover in childhood. It just gives me this tiny bit at the beginning because technically this is still Nerf Pass. So maybe I don't want to go that way then. And I thought, yeah, this is where I discovered the bouncy pad. This is the first time I actually seen what I think. So let's go maybe left here a little bit. Yeah, because there's this weird little spot that I couldn't get to before, I think, so... So right around here, for some reason I didn't mark it, or yeah, weird. I guess I guess I just didn't walk far enough. Or was this the, or was this the one that I was that was blocked? Well, there's a little bit of top lift there that I need to check out. So I'm gonna check that out. Ow. Let's go down here real quick. There we go, got that. We have a little spot here. Technically this is child bit too, I guess, so maybe I'll try that side. Ow. There we go. So what do we got on this side? Awakening grasp. Oh, that's one of the things that one person had. Yeah, so we're back at child bed. Oh, wait. I saw this. What do we got here? Okay. We got through it. Morrow legs. Okay, we got a new set there. Okay, so the the blue ones actually go by relatively quick. Oh, that's a wall we can break from the other side. Okay, I'm really hoping we find a surrogate on this side of it though, because it's a bit of a waste to get either from here to here. Well, there's that surrogate I could take in Feaster's Lair though, but. If need be, I'll just warp from wherever I... If I die, I'll just warp. Okay, spikes. Hmm. I also didn't quite check out the top there. We'll get back to that.
Okay, so we're already back here. Marrow hands. Yeah, we're back. Alright, so let's just go the other way. Because now, from this surrogate, I can go straight on. But I'll probably warp to this one. Technically, that's still closer, so... Hmm. Falling with style? Alright. Ow. Oh, thanks, I guess. <laughs> Did not expect that. But oh man, I am probably screwed. Oh boy. Run me! Ow. It, it stopped. I shouldn't have jumped. I forgot I, I forgot I don't need to jump over the teeth. Uh, but yeah, I think I'm gonna warp over there. That'll save me some time, so let's warp. Uh, Feaster's Bear, Lair, uh, Mowlers? Uh, no, it was the other one. Sunken Bones. Okay, so we can't cross the lightning there, so I'm not gonna bother with that. See, I'm a lot faster. So, boop. Slide down. Actually, yeah, we got that already. Just making sure. So, probably that path to the left of the teeth will lead me to that breakable wall I smacked. That was close. I'm not gonna lie, I thought I was gonna get smackadoodled. Run! Why did it stop running? Really? That's it? There's no way this is just it, right? No punching here. I guess that's it. Hmm. I feel like I'm missing something or a direction I'm supposed to be going that I'm not getting. Because I don't have the ability to use the... Can I break this? No. Hmm. I am confuzzled! Alright. Hmm. Let's just go up to Nerf Root then. Yeah, this, this episode, I'm kind of meandering. I, I don't really have the tip that I got, like, memorized, so probably next episode I'll make use of it. I remember the shop part, but not the rest of it, unfortunately. I'm sorry. But, uh, let's see. Let's just finish up here, just to check these rooms, I guess. Wait, what? What the hell? Uh, you know what? Let's... So we need to go back... This way... I think... Oops. Okay. Well, I guess uh, I'll take that. Not the worst that could have happened. Oh, wait a minute. No? Nope. Boom.
Okay, so we want to go up from here. Didn't get that item. That's not what I meant to do, but okay. Oh, well, I'll take that, I guess. Let's see. There's a little spot there. Maybe that's just the ceiling. But it's, ah, what? I didn't jump, apparently? Whatever. Also, there was a spot. Uh... Where it was one of those spike, yeah, right here. Okay, got it. So maybe over here is where the guy is. Hopefully. No. Where the hell is he? Is he on the left? Did I just forget to go this way? Maybe. I mean, there's a lot of electricity here. Ah, okay, I need to run. Yeah, there he is. Okay, I can't make it with running. What the hell? Uh, how am I supposed to make that then? There we go. It's a timing thing. I haven't fought one of these guys in a while. Too early. Fuck it. Um, I'm done. <laughs> Alright, we got rid of the electricity. So... Um, I don't even know if there's a ceiling there or not. There's also that bottom part, but I don't know if this... This thing that I just disconnected, will that get rid of the red lightning as well? Or just the bl I think it was just the blue, right? I don't quite remember. But it did at least get rid of the one guy, so he won't be doing this stupid red spike attack. Nope. <laughs> the, the red... Uh... Um... Yeah, I think we're gonna have to call it there. I'm sorry this episode probably was not the most exciting because I didn't find anything or bosses or any real way to go. So Childbit might be a dead end for now, or I'm missing a path I need to take to be able to get the new ability. And I still have not found the, found the missing boss here in Feaster's Lair. Maybe I can do more stuff in Gloom Nest? I haven't been there enough, I feel. And now that I... Uh, let me see. Uh, there is something I can do. So, let me do this. Uh, use this. Oh, I have to equip it. Boom. Up the pad. Get me out of here! I'm gonna unequip it because I don't plan on having that all the time. I'm only gonna use it when I need to, basically. Oops. How do I... There we go. Okay, so if we do all the way back to this one. I noticed that I think... Uh, I kind of like... Tried, was trying to figure out what happened. So on the first episode... Uh, I got to this wall, right? It was... Where was it actually? Was it here? I think it was here. Kill everything in my path. Uh, let's see. 
Flip sort of these guys for easy Ardor generation. I'm just gonna punch this guy. I'm not gonna bother. I'll check that item later. It's probably just a nail though. Yeah, it was right before uh, the map. So I'm just gonna only attack enemies that are really in my way. This wall. So I glitched my way through it, I think. Yeah, I was supposed to break it, but I glitched my way through it. Uh, I did, I did like a swipe attack with the sword, and it like got me through the wall. So I clipped through it, and that's why I couldn't go back this way. So now that I can go this way, I want to check out this little room here with the spikes, because I, I kind of accidentally glitched myself out of it for now. But now that I could, I could warp back. I can check out that room finally. Because I've been wanting to for a long time. Oh, hello. Bye. Alright. So, right over here... There was this room. With a bunch of spikes. Ow. The ground already fell. Hmm. What if I reset that? I think maybe with the run, uh, uh, well, I'm not sure. A lot of the floor just broke on its own. So I want to just check real quick. Does the floor respawn? And if it does, can I make it with run? If it doesn't, oh well, I just leave and come back to this later. So let's see. Nope, it just breaks. Hmm. So let me check something. I'm not going to use my mask. I just want to check the menu because maybe there's something I can uh, do. So... See, this one might be alright. It could buff me a little bit. But let's see. Is it a hint to have... Oh, walk slowly. You know what? We have one. Let's use it. You can now press left stick to walk slowly. I'm not a fan. Walk slowly. Wait, why? How do I use it? Yeah, that, that was a hint. I saw there was like that enemy. This one. So press to walk slowly. So I did to be like tiny. No, I'm running. Okay, I have to click the stick and then move. Yeah, this guy right here, that's the hint. Because, you know, you get it from that guy. So No. Oh, come on. I did it just now. I'm clicking the stick. There we go. Yeah, click stick is not the best button, I say. But let's just do this. I really wish it was a different button. But whatever. We're pulling it off. So what is mystery item over here? The Maul Sword. Mm, I'll check it out. Probably I can't use it, but I can say I got it. Okay, so uh, I'm not going to refund this just in case there's another area like this that you have to walk slowly. I still find it kind of goofy that that's not like a default ability. Like, where's my just crouch walk instead, you know? But whatever. Not a fan of that. That I have to spend a trade point for that. Like, yeah, I can refund it, but that's still resources I need to use. 
But uh, I'm going to go to Mowlers here, and that's where I'm going to end the episode. I know this wasn't, as I mentioned before, very exciting, let's call it. But, you know, sometimes we'll have one of those because I'm doing this game blind. Like, yeah, the tips are, are nice, but I can't remember everything uh, off the top of my head. But I am reading the comments for tips, so if you have tips, make sure to leave them. Anyways, if you liked the episode or the video in general or the series in general, like, comment, and subscribe. Leave a nice comment. Leave a mean comment. That is all up to you, and it's all right with me. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.